These are mine. <laughs> I think you see a difference here. Like, look at this. It's almost as big as my hand. Like, look at this one. It's a pretty big. Well, they're not super huge, but decent potatoes, especially that one. And I also got Mickey Mouse. Hi guys, I hope you liked the beginning part of the video. It's like the best bits of my video. Well, I think it's the best bits of my video or what's important to part, part of the video. Anyways, uh, if you liked what you saw, can you please really like and subscribe and click the bell. It really helps my channel, especially since I'm trying to go to a thousand subscribers this year. Uh, every like counts, every subscription counts, and seeing the bell really tells the algorithm to pump out my videos or show them to more people. It really helps out a lot. So let's get to the video, guys. Hello! Welcome back to my channel. Today's Sunday! Whoop whoop! And today is a garden day. So today ate breakfast. I haven't ate breakfast yet. But before we do, we gotta go let the chickens out and we gotta fence. We gotta fix some of the fence because it's not quite strong enough to keep them in yet because the, the gate is kind of weird. But we just gotta staple in some staples real quick and I can finally eat breakfast. And then we're gonna go work in the garden pulling all the weeds. On my side, anyways. Right, Dad? Right. I'm gonna pull the weeds on my side, but I'm gonna pull the weeds on his side and we'll see who gets done quicker. Right, Dad? Right. Anyways, guys. Let's get this started. I will cut back in a minute. Hi, guys. I'm back. What? I think the chickens are eating your corn. I think they are, too. Look at them. I know. You're getting ears on them. Uh, I'm going to have to... Yeah, look at that. Yeah, they tore the crap out of them. This is some crap. You know what that means. They got to go. Yep, they got to go. They'll be eating mine. They got to go. Kings, probably gonna be eating my squash and everything yeah, else. Get in there. They're probably gonna be eating everything else. Oh, yeah. Uh, now I'm mad. <laughs> I got some big old squash coming on, but. Ah, I smell cabbages. Look, that one's forming a head now. That has a small head. I gotta pick it this time before it goes to seed. <laughs> Rotten. Bees on there? Yeah, I do actually. Look at them. There's a couple of honeybees. Where? Right there in this one. See them? There's little tiny. I think they're honeybees or something. See them? There's some kind of bee. They're all over it. No, they're not. They're too small. But there's something all over it. <laughs> Jake, we gotta go fix the chicken's house, Jake. Or chicken run. The giant chicken run, which is what I called it in yesterday's video. What is with all these crows? <laughs> You know, having crows in your yard is bad luck, depending on how many there are. <laughs> yeah, I'm serious. If you see crows in your yard, depending on the number, it could be good luck or bad luck. Don't don't ask. Oh, yeah, I know. Good. They went out and they went out bad. So we got to hammer the bottom in and some across the top and should be good to go. Where's the gate? I don't even see it. Don't even see the gate. <laughs> What? Well, will you hammer the net? You filming, are you? No. Maybe. <laughs> what? Well, we need to get the, get everything out of the car and we'll start. Yeah, well, if you do it right. Well, all you gotta do is just. I'll show you. What are we doing? Let's hammer this. We know how to hammer a couple here and a couple across the bottom. Yeah. And a couple and a couple of that side. <laughs> Hi, Jacob. You know, I can't handle worth a crap. Dad, how'd you bust your tail light? Really? Is it legal? Yeah. Pass it, it passed inspection like that? Really? Chickens went out. Alright, guys, we got work to do. I will cut back in a little bit. So, hi, right, guys, I'm back. We finished what we need to do to make it safe enough for the chickens to be free. Let's see what they do, see how they react. Ready? Go! <laughs> yeah, they ran right to the food. There's one on the nest. There's one on the nest. The big one! It's a big one! There's all four little ones are there! He just looks like... I know. Look, they went out. <laughs> They're mad. Look at it. These ones don't care. There's plenty of water over there. We moved up all your water and everything. Go explore your new home. I know. 
Hmm. <laughs> Here comes the big chickens. I know. You. Gee, wait, that chicken just it exploded. Huh? They're not going stir crazy. None. They're mad. Look, these ones are really mad. The babies are really mad. Why are they so mad? <laughs> They're trying to run down there. Sorry, chickens. It's for your own safety. <laughs> Sorry, chickens. It's for your own safety. Look, that one's really wanting out bad. They'll find shade eventually. Our peace of mind. My mom's peace of mind, you mean. What, the ones to the... The big nails. The little nails. I never got them out of the Jeep. Oh, that one's hotter. I don't know what. He needs to go find somewhere to... Drink some water. Look, it's trying to jump over the fence. Look, the black one. You guys can't fly. Especially that way. That one's the highest part of the fence. Yeah, there's a whole shade tree back there. Go figure it out. <laughs> You're gonna help me out here. That one's hot. Look at it. he's. I know they just don't know. The black chickens are are colonizing it. You don't know what you don't know. You don't know what you don't know, huh? Can I go eat breakfast now? Yeah, can you go eat lunch? He didn't. Well, I'm enjoying the chicken. Trying to figure out how to get out. I know he's hot. I thought she was sure fence diving down there, spraying down, down that way. Do you realize how much briars we have to get out in trees and stuff? Not that much. Well, look how much she got up there. I didn't do nothing up there. Look, he's trying to jump out. Nope, couldn't make it. Do you have water in there? Yeah, water. <gasps> I put water over there. Look, black, this black one's drinking. He's trying to figure out how to get out. Look, that, that. Look at the. Yeah, he's the smart one. That's the leader. He's gonna go beat him up. They're like, hmm. They just ate sawdust. You guys gotta move so I can get out now. Go and eat the chicken. Yeah, go in there. Go back there in the shade. Area. Go back to the shade area. Shade area. Go back there. Yeah, now it's gone. Look, they're finally gonna go get some water. Some water, cause the black chickens are over here. Yeah. Yep. Why does he do that? What do they do that for? They're hot. Yep. I know. You should have let them out sooner. Yep. Oh, look at... <laughs> They're crazy. Open the gate and let me out so I can go eat. <laughs> Guys, I'll come back in a few minutes and we'll see if any escaped today and I'll let you know. Then. No, not yet. We still got to put things on here so we can... Yeah, we're going to put a board here so we can actually put a thing across and another one down here. At the... Yeah. Anyway, guys, I will come back in a few minutes. Hi, right, guys. I'm back. I want to show you something. Right, Dad? You ready? You... Mm -hmm. I got to show him your potatoes. We got so, here are his potatoes. These are also his down here. 
This is probably his biggest potato he got. Okay? Okay. Just, just, okay. <laughs> I gotta go and uh, show you this, guys. Look, look. <gasps> Hold on. So, uh, those are my dad's potatoes. These are my. <laughs> I think you see a difference here. Like, look at this. It's almost as big as my hand. Like, look at this one. It's a pretty big. Well, they're not super huge, but decent potatoes, especially that one. And I also got Mickey Mouse. <laughs> but, <laughs> my average potato is as big as his biggest potato, guys. Like, that's. That's saying so. I know I made like 30 pounds of potatoes from like a tip from like two foot yeah about 10 pounds so yeah says something dad hmm said I do better than you uh, I mean what tomatoes you get so far don't even aha uh -huh. they tell about the corn yeah the raccoons is eating your corn well we gotta do something with them well you know what to do you don't yes okay <laughs> I'm about ready to Eating my freaking stuff. Anyways, let's go check on the chickens up here and see how they're dealing with their new habitat. Go see what they're doing up here with their habitat they got going on. There's a kitty cat. Meow, meow. <laughs> see if they even escaped or got out <laughs> yet, which I'm surprised they haven't really tried too bad. But yeah, I dug up all my dead potatoes and that's what we got. <laughs> That was only from two five pound bags, about 10 pounds, maybe 50. I think it was three. I think it was three. Yeah, so 15 pounds, about 30 pounds. Yeah, about double what we put in. Or at least still be trying to get out. Chicky dude, you can't get out. Go play. You got all this space. You can get out. You can't get out. chickens you, you can't get out hey you can't get out chickadoos where's the little chickens at <laughs> I don't see them anywhere I don't see any little chickens anywhere there you go seriously I don't see them anywhere this is way too big for eight chickens Way too big. We gotta get. I think we're getting like 12 chickens and like a couple ducks. So we'll have 20 chickens and a couple ducks. And I think we're gonna get a rooster also to fill in this space. <laughs> they. Where's the little chickens? I don't see a single one of them. Did they get eight or what? Eat the little chickens. Don't lie. Oh, I see one. He's over there by the gate, or the chicken coop. We still gotta fix his gate because the gate was not even whatsoever here. So, yeah. You gotta get a board and we're just gonna hammer a board like here so it's not such a big gap and then we're gonna bolt it across. Not bolt it, but we'll put uh, hinges in that we have up here somewhere. Burr -burr! Chick, 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 dude. Are you guys mad? Huh? You guys mad? They're mad. They're mad at us. Like, what do we do? You didn't do nothing. It's just you're dying too often for the fox. Especially the little ones. They're just dying like every day. Anyways, guys. I will cut back in a little bit. So, hi, guys. I'm back. So, here's my potato crop for the year because all my potatoes died. I didn't do very bad. Uh, First time, look at this, I actually got a pretty big sized potato there. I mean, the average size is kind of small. I mean, some got burnt because it wasn't very deep in the ground. Next year, I'm going to do two big long rows completely across the garden, get get 50 pound bags and just pull them as deep as I can and just let them go to town. Next year, guys. <laughs> That's the goal for next year. Also, next year, we're going to, here pretty soon, actually, because the garden's basically dead because everything, we haven't got a single tomato yet out of the garden, waiting for them to ripen up. Or peppers, because the peppers didn't do very well <laughs> this year either. Uh, yeah. Well, I'm going to have all kinds of squash. Like spaghetti squash, pumpkins. No watermelon. They completely died. But next year, I can't wait till next year, because I'm already thinking about next year. 
I'm gonna have a huge variety of different things. I'm gonna go plant like, cause next year I think I'm gonna have majority gardens. So yeah, so next year I'm gonna plant. As soon as the garden dies off completely, I'm just gonna dig it up, dig the hay into the ground, which probably isn't the best idea. And then I'm just going to throw some, a bunch of cover crops, winter rye and, uh, it was winter rye and Austrian winter peas cover crop. And we're just gonna make a cover crop cocktail. Throw it all over the garden. It's always very compacted in the garden, like very, very bad. Like you can't even dig it it's so hard. So, and also we had a really bad bug pressure this year, which I don't know what the heck was on with the bug. Probably could be in. Dig it up. We'll dig it up once in the end of fall, once in the beginning, like at the end of fall and beginning of spring, and then we're gonna cover crop it through winter and be done with it. Wham bam! Thank you, man. And hopefully it'll really rejuvenate the soil, and then maybe we should get some more compost and just sprinkle it all over the garden and be done with it and dig it in. And hopefully it'll help with our weeds and make the soil better because the soil is very, very compacted, like super hardcore compacted. I don't know what's wrong with it. But, yeah, I can't get over how big some of my potatoes are. I mean, they're not, like, super huge potatoes, like, or even, like, most of them aren't this big. But I got a couple of them. Like, most of them are about this size. Or little tiny ones. But, for what I did, probably got 25 pounds, 30 pounds out of, like, 15 potatoes. 15 pounds of potatoes. Next year, I'm going to do 50 pounds. And I'm going to go two big loaves all the way across the garden. And plant them as deep as I can. And be done with it. Right? Right. Anyways, guys, I will talk to you guys a little bit. I'm going to vlog. So, bye, guys. I'm back. Going to get a vlog. Uh, did a lot today. Fixed up the rest of the chicken gate thing. Let the chickens out. They hate us. They was giving us crap when we went and put them in at night. They was really mad at us. Should have filmed it, but didn't. Anyways, uh, tomorrow we got big plans. Got to get up kind of early because I got to get my hair cut because I look like a freaking sheepdog and my hair is ridiculous. Going to an actual barber, which they're open, so I don't, I don't really want to, but I need to. And I don't like my hair is always like I can't really cut my hair by myself. I know my family has to do it, so I actually had to go get my hair cut. It's driving me nuts for so long, but yeah, I'm gonna wear a mask and everything. Obviously, if I even can wear a mask while you get your hair cut, I don't even know. So tomorrow, haircut day, it's gonna be look completely different. I always look completely different to get a haircut. Anyways, guys, I will talk to you guys. Tomorrow, roll the outro. Hi right, guys, you made this far to the video. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. But if you really want to check out more, there's two videos here, here, and you can subscribe by clicking this button thing here.